I know whatever the device you are using to watch this videos, batteries are the one that helps to power the device. Not exactly. What? How? Then how are you watching this video? In TV, bro. Oh, okay. Hmm. Then I start again. If you are watching this video on mobile or laptop, it has batteries inside it, which may made up of steel or plastic. But what if I told you there is a battery made up of just water and paper? But why would we need a battery made up of water and paper? According to the UN's global e-waste monitor, humans generate around 53.6 million tons of electronic waste globally in 2019. Out of that, India produces about 3.2 million ton of e-waste, standing out as a third largest e-waste producer in the world. The electronic part contains toxic elements like lead, cadmium, and mercury. When the electronics are discarded on the land, their poisonous chemical could leach into the soil and water bodies and pollute them. This could end up in serious health problem for the living beings. So several organizations like WHO, International Solid Waste Association, several countries, and some conscious researcher are taking action to reduce. and recycle electronic waste in the upcoming years as a part of that researcher at the cellulose and wood laboratories of swiss federal laboratories for material science and technology has bought an intelligent solution the paper and water batteries so in today's science side we will explore the technology behind the water and paper battery A traditional battery consists of a case made of zinc which act as negative terminal and a copper rod which act as positive terminal. Between these two terminal ammonium chloride is filled in the form of paste and act as an electrolyte. This electrolytes allow the electric current to flow from negative terminals to the battery's positive terminal. To keep everything in the battery working fine these are encased in metal or plastic. When these traditional batteries are discarded apart from the chemicals such as aluminum chloride the metal and the plastic encase will also end up as e-waste and pollute the environment but the new paper and water battery developed by the researcher are more eco-friendly the new batteries consist of a paper strip the front end of the paper strip is printed with special ink made of graphite and it's act as negative terminal Strips rear end is printed with ink made up of zinc and it acts as positive terminal apart from this the paper is infused with salt and contain thousands of salt molecule when the paper is damped with water the salt molecule will dissolve in water the salt dissolved in water is an excellent conductor of electric current as you saw in 3 idiot this will make the flow of electric current from the negative terminal to the positive terminal of paper battery The researchers say it will take around 20 second to activate the battery after the paper is moistened with water. Once it is activated, it can produce stable electricity of 1.2 volt until the paper dries out. With this voltage, we can power up various electronic devices like alarm clock, medical diagnostic device like blood sugar testing devices, environmental sensors such as carbon dioxide sensor, carbon monoxide sensor, etc. The researcher believe that improving this technology could power up several devices and help reducing the electronic waste at very large scale. And if you want more video like this then subscribe the channel and until then keep learning and keep imbibing.